Well, the history of this ranch, my great-great-grandfather, uh, George Hurst, uh, purchased a Spanish land grant in 1865. He had one son with Phoebe Apperson Hurst, and that was W.R., William Randolph Hurst, who, of course, is famed for building the structure up behind us. And he grew the ranch up to 270,000 acres. And now, after the conservation deal, the ranch is 80,000 acres, which is about 128 square miles. What we're doing here at the Hearst Ranch is raising a 100% grass-fed and grass-finished cattle. And the cattle are primarily Angus and Hereford. And it's a, a genetic mix that's been on this ranch for about 150 years. Historically, it's, it's nice kind of going backwards to uh, kind of get back to raising beef the way it was you know, in the old days. The diversity in the grasses here is a mixture of annual, perennial grasses, forbs, legumes, and cattle uh, you know, that have evolved over the years as grazers need a lot of that in their diet. You know, it's a natural uh, smorgasbord or salad bar for cattle, as you would say. The cattle are the centerpiece of the operation, and they are very, very well respected here. They live in a beautiful place, and they're allowed to engage in their natural behaviors as free-ranging foragers. So that results in a product that, that is tender. Hearst Ranch grass-fed beef uh, enjoys a very high omega-3 to 6 ratio, uh, increased levels of beta carotene and vitamin E, and as a result of having less uh, marbling, it actually has less calories than a highly marbled meat. So it's a healthy, delicious beef. It has a distinctive beef flavor to it that seems to be lost in, in the modern supermarket. Uh, we love beef. Our story is just a little bit different. We like to parallel it in with the sustainable cuisine, the conservation easement, the increasing health concerns that people have about their food, the origin of it, and how it's treated. And uh, we do it the old-fashioned way. There's a saying in the cattle business that, you know, you go slower and get there faster. I think uh, our product is valued for its tenderness and its flavor and for its authenticity. I think people want to know who raises their food, and we're very, um, upfront about what we do and our production standards we're very proud of them we don't want to hide them we want to publicize them we're doing the right thing we're a sustainable operation we're humane handlers we have a very great respect for our cattle and the end result is a delicious product that's valued by chefs and gourmands across the country cheers cheers